Hi, it's Saturday. The 23rd way to win with people, to influence people, is never say you're wrong. That is a follow-up to yesterday's uh, lesson when I said don't uh, point out people's faults in public. There's a story that Dale Carnegie was invited by Sir Ross, and, and they were honoring him. Uh, I don't remember the occasion, but Sir Ross was telling a story. And at the end of the story, he says that this story was taken from the Bible. And Dale Carnegie, um, no one asked him. He blurted out, no, that's not from the Bible. That's Shakespeare who told that story. And Sir Ross was like, uh, no, you're wrong. I am sure that it's in the Bible. So sitting next to Dale Carnegie was uh, 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 Grammon, and Grammon was an expert on Shakespeare. And so Dale Carnegie says to him, please, you heard the story. Can you tell him that that's a, a story from Shakespeare? And Grammon kicks him under the table and he smiles to Sir Ross and says, Sir, you are correct. Dale, you're wrong. That story is from the Bible. And Dale Carnegie stays quiet and the party resumes. Later on, as they were both going home, Dale says to, to Grammon, listen, that story is from Shakespeare. And Grammon said, yes, that's Hamlet, Act 5, Scene 2. But Dale, we were a guest in his home. He did not ask you. He was just telling a story. Why did you want to embarrass him in front of everyone? So, I, you know, it, we save face for him. Friends, many of us, we have a hab have bad habit of correcting people as if, you know, we are the, the police and the authority of everything. Yes, if you want to correct the person, then you pull them to the side and you tell them privately, hey, that story is not from the Bible. That story is from Hamlet. But... If you want to win with people, if you want to influence people, never say to them publicly, you're wrong. Notice yesterday's story. Jesus did not say to Peter, you're wrong. You are going to betray me. No, he told him and spoke to him privately. And that's my thought as I sit in my office. Have a good day. Bye-bye.